guys, I am here with Maggie. Um, she is the Full Body Silicone Maggie by Andrea Arcello. And um, yeah, she is a, she is an absolutely amazing baby. I haven't done a video of her in a while and I wanted to go ahead and change her into this dress. Um, it is a dress by Ralph Lauren and it's like this really cute seersucker kind of material. Um, it's got like ruffles at the top and bottom and it's really, really pretty. I, um, I don't shop at Ralph Lauren very much, but, um, I do think that, I mean, when they do have sales, um, sometimes you can get some really good deals and they have some very, very cute baby items. And so, um, so I just wanted to mention that, but yeah, I wanted to go ahead and, um, get her changed. And, um, I, actually have a bit of a shocking announcement for you guys with regards to to Maggie um, those of you guys who have been following my channel for a while um, and you know I know that there, there have been so many videos and sometimes it's impossible to watch them all um, I had made a video about I think it was the one about are you done collecting and just feeling a little bit overwhelmed by just how large my collection has become and just the feeling of like you know maybe I should try to let go of you know, some of the babies that are not portrait babies in my nursery. So I've already had somebody express interest in Ella. Um, so that that's something I'll just like kind of keep in mind for the future. Not ready to let her go quite yet because I've um, only had her a year and I still really love her as well. And, you know, I absolutely still love Maggie as well. But, uh, you know, I, she has armatures and I'm not, I'm just not really an armatures kind of gal. Um, I think at the end of the day, I just prefer my babies without, but you know, guys, she is just the most amazing, amazing silicone. Her silicone is so super soft. And there's a lady who messaged me saying that she, Maggie is her dream baby. And this is the baby that like, she just like wants so much. And I know different people have like messaged me with interest in Maggie in the past and I don't remember who it was or anything like that. And and I'm not, I, I'm not like actively trying to sell her anything, but I kind of was, I think when I got the message, I was actually on my cruise and, and I just kind of thought, you know, like also thinking about how expensive <laughs> this, the cruise was and everything like that. Um, I kind of thought, you know, maybe I should just be, do the responsible thing and, take her up on her offer to purchase Maggie and, and she, you know, and, you know, I got a good price for her or a fair price. And I just thought, you know, why not? Right. Cause I have so many, it's, it's such a tough call cause I love this baby. And, you know, even just like, so that I guess the thing is like, she's, she can't pay, she couldn't pay for her in full. So, so we have like a six month layaway plan going on. And it's such a long layaway that I don't want to have to not interact with Maggie for six months. I don't know if that's going to make it harder at the end of the day. It's kind of like when you're kind of like fostering, you know, a baby that you know you're going to have to give up eventually. But but I also kind of feel like, well, you know, she, I mean, I, I, I'm really careful, obviously, with all my dolls and everything like that. And But um, I just want to do the occasional outfit change and, and chat video, right? So... But yeah, I feel like since she's still in my possession, and you never know with layaways as well, sometimes they can fall through. So, um, so anyway, oh, she's looking so cute. Oh my goodness. She, her silicone really is such a dream, you guys. I, this is why, um, I'm so excited about my second baby, Ethan. Like he, like this, the silicone just, it's so, oh, it's so wonderful. I, I can't even describe it. It's, it's, it's her premium silicone and it's just super super soft like I, I wish she didn't have the armature so she would just be totally super soft all the way through but a lot of people love the armatures and so because for for posing it's great for pictures and stuff like that but I'm just weird that's just my own <laughs> my own preference this dress feels a little long on her but that's okay anyway so yes yeah, so I don't know um if you guys have like you know, when babies are on layaway, I think it can be a tricky thing, but, um, so hopefully she's trustworthy and it kind of all works out. But, um, and of course now that I see her, I'm like, Oh man, did I make the right decision to sell her? I don't know. But, um, 
she's an absolute dream baby, so it's not an easy decision, but I just think financially, I feel, I feel kind of bad having so much money tied up in my collection, and I just think the, the right thing to do is probably to, to thin it out a little bit, and, um, yeah, and so there may be some other tough choices coming, coming down the line as well, so I'll just keep you all posted there, but, but yeah, that's my big news, um, that Maggie is actually, um, her sale is pending, you know, she, her, her new mommy made her first payment on her, and it will be about a six month process, um, before she goes home, but in the meantime, she can enjoy her here on video, and say hi to her, and she's absolutely incredible, she really, really is, um, I just, oh, I just love, I, I love this thigh, this is like my favorite, <laughs> favorite feature of Maggie. It's like this thigh and it's just so, it's just perfection and this little foot and her toes. I mean, she's just so incredible and she's still just absolutely perfect. So anyway, ah, oh, you guys, <laughs> decisions, decisions. It's just one of those things of, of collecting, you know, we can't keep them all and, um, but I'm going to have a hard time sending her away. It's going to be hard. Like I, I still am in shock that I decided to sell her. Um, I don't know what Kool-Aid I was drinking when I was on the cruise, but, um, but I think in my heart, I, I know it's the right, right thing to do. And, and I know when I was, um, but yeah, and the ones that I have to think hard about are my other two, um, silicones, my, uh, my Emerson and my, my Ella, who's my, who I call Mia and then Emerson, I call Evelyn. So Mia and Evelyn, those are the, the two. Um, but yeah, I, I, I don't, I'm not planning to do anything at this point right now. Um, the baby that might be more likely on the chopping block, if you will, or might be more likely to get sold would, would be this new cloth body baby. Um, cause I haven't, really bonded with her yet um because she's brand she she would be brand new so we'll kind of see but um anyway guys I wanted to just share that announcement and Miss Maggie I think looks so cute in this dress and um let me know if you guys have you know kind of just your experiences with layaways and you know, if somebody has a doll on layaway for a long time, do you just pack the baby away and just don't touch the baby during that time period? I think I, I ended up, I did do that with my Noah, who was my Gabigail by Claire Taylor. Cause at that point I felt like the baby wasn't mine anymore, but I do also feel like six months is a really long time, um, to not interact with this doll and to just hang on to her. So, so I might do the occasional video with her, but I'm not going to be handling her very much, obviously. So um, all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. And I, and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will talk to you later and see you on the next video. Bye.